take a bunch of makanas or the fox seeds or the lotus seeds and then dry roast them dry roast them in the motion very gently So the ingredients for makana laddus or fox nut sweet balls are basically dry roasted makanas. You need to roast them in the light heat and how you will find out that they are well done is keep frying them and then once they are a little bit crunchy like see how this is crunchy there is no sogginess meaning they are well done. So just uh, keep on testing them for the crunchiness and then you will know that the makanas are done after that you will need um, these are roasted uh, blacks uh, black grams we call it dalia dal this is already roasted but roast it a little bit you can add any kind of dry fruits too i have added almonds here and the peanuts that are dry roasted Use any kind of seeds that you want. I have added sesame seeds and the sunflower seeds and these are dry roasted too. And then add these, um, if you have the desiccated dry coconut, you can use that. Or just have the dry coconut and you can grind it well. And then you will need jaggery powder. Other than that, to bind it, you will need uh, ghee or clarified butter. So you once you have dry roasted it you need to make a fine powder and then add jaggery to it and the clarified butter and then bind it into the laddus and your laddus will be done so here are the ingredients so now i have grinded the makhana into very fine powder as you can see after this i'm adding like the desiccated coconut to the dry coconut that I made it into a fine powder so you can see right here and then similarly I'm gonna grind all of these ingredients too. This is the roasted chana dal that has been added to with the powdered form and now you can see here I have grinded the peanuts and the almond too. So this is all fine grinded. Now I will add it to the main mixture here. Now after adding everything I have added the jaggery powder too. So after this you just need to mix everything and here is the clarified butter that I am going to add to this mixture and then just bind the laddus or the sweet balls. See, I have added the clarified butter or the ghee in it and now this ingredient like this mixture is so good it will bind up easily on its own. So all you have to do is just mix the mixture very well and start making the laddus. So the beautiful laddus full of nutrition are ready. I call it power packed sweet balls. And just keep on making and you can store them in the container and they will be good for I would say a good couple of 15 to 20 days. So of that mixture that I showed you, these many laddoses or these many sweet balls is what I got. So yummy, nutritious, power packed full of health benefits. I hope you guys will try it next time and do share in the comment section how it turned out and whether your family liked it or not.